would it be fair to say, and I, you know, wanted you to come on because I was studying, you know, Mindcore technologies, the IT, and kind of trying to understand the intricacies of how this all works. And I came up with the realization that IT itself, as you are a strategist, like anyone else as a consultant and advisor, is a consciousness. Uh, it, it's actually the collective consciousness of your business. And, I, you know, when, when you start running parallels of technology in the universe and understanding and awareness, you know, when I listen to you talk and I do research on your company, I really can't help but to think that you're kind of a, a guru of a consciousness and, you know, you turn away business, you, you literally are saying, you know, what collective consciousness do you want for your business? And I'll effectuate the best tools in order to expedite and to secure and all those things. Is that a fair assessment? And if so, how do you relate to that? That's the best question I've been asked by anybody. I do a lot of podcasts. <laughs> Listen, I, oh. I, I wake up, here's the reason. I wake up and meditate every day. I've gone through my own experience in life of awareness and mindfulness. And um, for me, it's like I live in a space of gratitude and appreciation. But that was a, a, a lifelong journey. I'm, I'm almost 48. That was a journey, man. You, you go through your, your stuff, right? You, you, you fail, you fall on your face. You have, we all have trauma and drama, right? Um, so, yeah, I do bring it to my business. My business is, is, is me. It's an extension of my personality, my behavior, my beliefs. Uh, and the people that I hire and, and bring into my company to work there um, to be part of the team, we have to have that shared mindset or you can't even work in my company. And it really does come from this place of you've got to want to, from the heart, from a place of true um, meaning, want to serve and help people. So yeah, it, 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 it's very much about that. Um, and, and so it, it, I can feel when I meet somebody, if it just doesn't feel right, if the vibe doesn't feel right, if it's, um, if it's an opportunity, we're talking about business, I'll respectfully pass on it and I'll respectfully say, hey, you know what, maybe somebody else can help you because I could just feel we're not going to connect and they're not going to really receive my help openly, you know? So I'm a very, very spiritual guy. I'm not religious, but I'm spiritual. Mm -hmm. um, and that 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 meditation and, and the mindfulness, man, it, you just know when you connect with somebody and if, if the relationship is just going to work, you just know. And so many of my clients, um, like I have one of the largest PR firms in the country. We've been doing their IT for like 12 or 13 years. We, they want me every few weeks around the table with them, like having real conversations and they really care and they really listen and we really connect. And I've helped them build their company from 10 people to hundred people, you know, New York, LA, like that's a level of trust that it goes beyond. We just solve IT problems. It's really spiritual, you know?